Hello everyone, I'm Justin Fisher. Here's a look at some of today's top stories from 2 News Oklahoma. One person is dead following a multi-vehicle crash on 169. This happened around 5 a.m. near 36th Street, a chain reaction involving several vehicles, including a box truck. Our photographer on scene saw multiple agencies responding to this, and it did cause quite a backup during the morning rush hour. Authorities were able to get that crash clear just about 940 this morning. Again, one person did lose their life because of this, but it's unclear what originally caused that crash to happen. We are learning more about the woman shot by Tulsa police after a standoff in a Midtown neighborhood on Tuesday. Well, the next door neighbor and his wife shared this security video with two news. You can see police responding to the home. This is near 28th in Cincinnati. Well, we learned that the city of Tulsa took ownership of that home in 2017 through eminent domain, and that was for a stormwater and floodplain project. Well, city officials say that they asked the woman to leave the home multiple times over the last few years, and she got a final legal notice this summer. Her neighbor says that uh, he and his wife were on the deck when she threatened them with a sword. And that's when they called police. It escalated to the point where, unbeknownst to my wife and I, she had at least one firearm and she brought it out. Tulsa police have not released the woman's name nor provided an update on her condition. Of course, we'll keep you posted as we do learn more information. All right, let's take some time now to get over to meteorologist Brandon Wolf. Look at that forecast. Hey, Brandon. Hey Justin, another hot one today. We're going for 104 with partly cloudy skies. The record for today is 104, so it goes to show you just how warm it is for this time of year. Chance for a few showers and storms tonight and overnight through your Friday. 102 for Friday, and then we're into the upper 90s for the weekend. Chance for maybe a few more showers on Saturday, up to the triple digits once again early next week on Monday, along with mostly sunny skies. Chance for a few more showers and storms Tuesday and into the upper 90s.